boy hears Lady scream in neighborhood, then sees what she's running from and saves her life. Hi everyone. Consider yourself lucky because we have the right story just for you. Being a hero comes in all shapes and sizes. An action doesn't need to be big to help someone. Sometimes the most unexpected thing ever happens during the most unforeseen circumstances. It's great when people show a bit of backbone, but it's even better when their courage manifests itself in smart, calculated actions. Amazingly, a 14-year-old boy was able to carry this given characteristic. It was a Wednesday night when James was at home in Shepherd, Michigan. He was watching over his sibling Asil and 11 years old, and Angus, 2 years old because their father had to drive a few miles away to pick up his fiancée from work. Minutes after his father left, James heard a loud knocking at the door. He tried to ignore it at first, but the woman continued to frantically scream in panic asking them to let her in. James even recalled her saying, I would die if you don't open the door. Cautiously, the boy opened the door to find a young woman with bruises covering her face. She was holding her arms close to her body. One of them was broken. She rushed into the kitchen. She shouted that someone had kidnapped her and was trying to kill her. She even told the children that they needed to hide from there. The team remembered that his father had told him that in case of emergency, he should get everyone into one of the bathrooms, the only room in the house with no windows. James started his plan to make sure that everything will be fine. He acted quickly and locked the door, turned off the lights, and took the injured woman and got his siblings to climb into the bathtub. He even told his sister to call 911 while he retrieved the hunting knife he had just gotten for Christmas. Meanwhile, his father has just arrived at his fiancée's family business. Suddenly, he heard his cell phone ring. To his surprise, it was his frantic son on the other end. His son said something to the effect of there's a man outside the house and that he needs to go home as soon as possible. As soon as he heard those words from his son, they'd automatically rush home and while on their way, he asked his fiancée to keep James on the phone while waiting for some rescue. It wasn't long before they heard the alleged attacker, Eric Ramsay, beating his fists and shouting. He was forcing his way to the house. The seconds passed and things got even more terrifying when everything fell silent. When Eric couldn't force his way to the house, he retrieved a container full of gasoline and a match. The children and the young woman waited anxiously in the bathroom and hoped that help would arrive in time until finally James's father arrived. He hoped he would be able to surprise the intruder. He cut his lights off within a tenth of a mile hoping to catch the person outside. He didn't find the intruder, but instead found the bottom of the house. A glow, Hurston put out the fire with the sod of his body and his feet. He tried to break a window to get inside, not knowing if the intruder was in the house. The children finally opened the door when they spotted the cops in person met them in the living room. That's when the children started talking about the woman with them. Authorities quickly found her. She was injured, but amazingly calm. Paramedics cared for the woman, and the cops questioned her before she was taken to the hospital. Authorities also interviewed the children and informed them that they didn't have to worry about the man coming back, as the man was already taken down by the authorities. Later on, James together with his sister Aslin were hailed as heroes. Isabella County Police Chief Leo Majdowski believes James saved the woman's life. James' dad was proud of his son's quick thinking and courageous efforts. James will be honored with a life-saving award at a county commission meeting. He has gotten a lot of attention, but his family maintains that he simply did the right thing. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please hit the like button. If you want to see more videos, hit the subscribe button. And if you have something to say, please leave a comment.